Yo, what's going on guys? In today's video, we are going out to Sunflower Hills Golf Course for a college practice. We practice like four days a week and then on Friday we practice on our own. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, every day, all week, we are always practicing. So basically today it is, what day is it today? It's Wednesday. So we're going out there, we're doing drills today. Uh, obviously everybody in our last tournament just didn't putt well. We all had above 33 putts, I believe, which is awful. So I think that's why we're doing most of putting drills and chipping drills, and then we're gonna hit on the range. We're not really technically playing today. However, I might play on my own and record some footage of on-course play. Um, either way, I'm just giving you guys a little background of the college golf practice scene for me. This is not like a blanket statement. This is not what every college practice looks like but this is what my college practice looks like today. So let's get right to the course and right into the video. All right, here in the first drill, we have four sets of four putts. Basically all we're doing is starting with a left hand and hitting only left-handed putts. After that, we'll move on to the right hand and only hit right-handed putts. And right after that, we're going to hit putts only looking at the hole. So basically all this is is just feeling your putts in general and then being able to smooth out your stroke from there. Gets on audience, you know? Huh? What'd you say? Dude, you're garbage. Yeah, that was pointless even though I probably am garbage. Uh, looking at the hole right here, obviously moving on to these four putts. Our goal here is to make 10 out of 16. Here in this first set, we don't actually end up doing that. And then I think it takes us a few more tries at least before we end up getting it. But I will put that in time lapse so you guys don't have to be extremely bored of me just missing a bunch of putts. So finally, here's the actual set where I end up getting the record of 10 and 16. So basically, whenever I started doing this drill, my goal was always to get 10. Sometimes I get 12, sometimes I get 16, sometimes I get 10, but the score that I'm happy with is 10 because making all 16 is quite hard to be honest with you. Obviously, you will see me, I just hit uh, left-handed putts and then right-handed putts and I'm looking at the hole. And after this, I will obviously close my eyes for the last set. And unfortunately, I only have seven going into the last set, so I have to make three of four, and I missed the shortest one, so I have to make the last three. Made the third to last, and here's the second to last. Obviously, I ended up making it, and then I ended up making the last one to actually get the drill done. So basically here's just a bunch of time lapse of me hitting three footers going around the circle drill. I actually set up four tees, some people set up five tees, some people set up six tees. These are all two footers or three footers, I don't even know, but basically I'm just hitting a bunch of them and my goal is to make eight sets of four in a row. So you do the math, I think that's 32 putts in a row from two and a half feet, which is not that hard, but it's just a really good drill to actually feel the ball going in the hole. Here's the final set, or one of the final sets. I think this is the final set where I actually end up making uh, eight sets in a row. No, here we go. Here's the last set, and then boom, there's that drill. So in this drill, we're actually doing three tees set up, all at three feet, and then times that by another three feet, and then another three feet. So. We start with a three footer. The goal is to make 10 out of 10 putts. And when you make 10 out of 10 putts, you move on to the six footer. And from that six footer, you try and make eight out of 10 putts. And if you can't make the eight out of 10 putts, you just restart that six footer and keep going until you make eight out of 10 putts. So right here, that was 10 out of 10. Uh, made my first 10 putts. Obviously, everybody should from three feet. Now moving on to uh, the second set, which is the six footer, I ended up not making any of these first three, so I had to start over. Uh, unfortunately with this putt, it was kind of hard to really get down in the beginning, mainly because I couldn't really tell 
what the brake was doing, but moving on to try number two, I kind of got the brake down, but obviously it couldn't really get the speed down. Um, after I missed a couple of those putts, I had to restart again, and right here, I believe that's three out of the first four, moving on to the second four. I think I ended up making all but maybe, no, actually I think I made all of these right here. Uh, and so, nope. Never mind. That was actually three out of four on both of those first four. Moving on to the last two to seal the deal on that part of the drill. After that, we go to the nine footer. I kind of knew the break based off the six footer, so I think I ended up getting this one first try. Uh, I think it was ended up breaking like maybe three or four inches right to left virtually every putt. The key was getting that speed down and reading the grain right because these greens were extremely slow today and I wasn't really used to it from the last course we played where the greens were extremely fast. So obviously I ended up getting that done. I don't know how many I ended up making out of this, but I think it was like nine out of 10 or eight out of 10. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but that's what I think. I, I wasn't really paying attention. All right, this putting game is quite simple. You have two people, one setting up at each hole. You hit the ball back and forth. If you make one, you get a point unless the other person on his next putt makes it to cancel out the point. After that boring time lapse, we have Aiden here with the uphill putt and he sinks it. So he goes one up on me unless I make this putt here, which obviously I didn't end up doing. You have a chance to cancel. Oh my god. This guy doesn't know how to play this game. Got a chance, oh folks. My God. For redemption. Can you repeat what you just said about health? Yeah, if you don't... <laughs> Stop. If you do not take care of your body and fuel it properly, it's going to start to break down at the cellular level. Is that why my Sickness, wrist hurts? Is yes, that why my wrist hurts? Yes, it is. It is? Yes. You sure? Yes. 100%. You're going to get injuries, sickness. Yeah. All, All right, guys. That is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the little the college practice uh, session thing that we did there, putting and range session. But hey mom, do you have anything to say to the viewers until next time? No. Can you say until next Peace time? Peace out. Peace out. Isn't that yeah. what you always Hit say? Hit the camera. Hit the camera. Like oh. cover it up with your hand. Uh, no, a little more. There you go. That's good.